Good evening. Sometimes I can be slow at putting things together. For example, Scarecrow. I didn't realize Scarecrow was called Scarecrow because it scares crows, probably until sometime after I graduated from college. So what does this have to do with a sponsorship? In Springfield, Ohio, there's a race called the Happy Half. It's a half marathon that originally went from Springfield to Yellow Springs, both cool towns in Ohio, and I've signed up for uh, the race four times, and I've completed it three times. Got my shirts, shirts, shirt. Would have had another one, but uh, stupid injuries got in the way of that. During this whole time that I've run this, um, I've known a little bit about the origin of the race. Uh, it was a training race for a couple of people who were getting ready to do the Columbus Marathon in the fall. Um, I also knew that they were using it as a way to raise money for someone who had cancer or something along the lines of that. <clears throat> but I really didn't think that much more about it. I just thought, hey, it's cool. There's a half marathon in my town. I don't have to go out of town to go participate in one. And I was pretty excited. And it also has a very cool medal um, from Doug Frady's Glass Studios. Each one is custom made. So it's just a really uh, a, a cool race, and I was pretty excited about it. Um, last year, they made a change to the course, and instead of going from Springfield down to Yellow Springs, the whole course takes place in Springfield and highlights some of the cool things that we have in town. Uh, a Frank Lloyd Wright house, uh, the Springfield Museum, our parks, Wittenberg University, uh, along the, a lot of the bike paths that we have in town. And then it ends in uh, downtown Springfield. So it's pretty cool, cool overall race. Now, I guess this year when I signed up, I paid a little bit closer to the fundraising. The proceeds help support the Springfield Regional Cancer Center. In 2020, I lost my wife to cancer. Uh, we met with doctors and medical teams all around the state of Ohio, Springfield, Columbus, Cleveland, uh, throughout the whole town, or well, throughout the whole state. Um, but her treatment took place primarily in Ohio, I mean in Springfield, at the Springfield Regional Medical Center. She did have some treatments at the other places, but pretty much it was all done here. And the, we were always impressed with the doctors, the nurses, the staff, the volunteers there. They were so helpful. Um, they were understanding, they were patient, and we always felt important. They have lots of patients that are coming in there for this horrible disease, but they always made us feel very important. So after all of these years of running the Happy Half Marathon, it, it finally clicked where the funds were going to, the purpose of it. And that's why the King Mo Show is a sponsor of this year's Happy Half Marathon. This is a way for me to give back uh, to those who helped Melanie and I. And it's also going to help other people who are going through this challenging time. So... Um, I know most people are not ready to run a half marathon. If you are, that is awesome. But it's a large time commitment. Um, but there's four ways that you can help support the happy half. Number one, this year they've added the Hoppy 5K. It's approximately 3.1 miles takes place on the same day that the half marathon does. That's a very easy, trainable distance to walk or run. So I encourage you to sign up for that. Um, not everyone is close enough that they can partake in this. In the comment section, I'll put a link to my fundraiser page to help raise additional funds for the Happy Half and the Springfield Regional Medical Center. You can be a volunteer to help support the race. 
water stations, guiding people, handing out medals at the end, handing out shirts and packages whenever people come to sign up for the race, they always need volunteers. You can also just come out, cheer people on. It is a great motivator when you're running a race to have people, total strangers, just cheering you on. They don't know who you are, but they know what you're going through and their cheering really helps those of the people who are running the race, walking the race, doing whatever. As an added bonus, if you enter one of the races or if you sign up as a volunteer, I will buy you a beverage after I finish the half marathon, a beverage of your choice after I finish the half marathon. I'm not sure how many people will take me up on this, so I'm limiting it to the first 13.1 people, 13.1 because of 13.1 for the half marathon. Um, in the comments, you'll find the links to the marathon, the links to my, my donor page. Um, please share this with your family, with your friends. Um, I look forward to seeing you on August 13th. If you're concerned about signing up for the 5K or the, what that'll take and how to train for it, just reach out to me. I will help you through that. That's all. Thank you, and please share this.